Hi everybody, Fred Matheson with Athlon Outdoors here with you today. You know, a lot of times you get the luxury of taking you out on the range with me to test new guns. Well, today we have something new and fun to test. We're going to be talking about a new blade from our friends at Tops. This is their new short sword called the Kumukage. It's a very nice sword, a very unique design, got a cool story behind it. This is not a slash and dash machete type blade. This is a for real short sword. We've done quite a bit of testing and we're going to share that with you. We did some Tamishigiri, traditional Japanese samurai type cutting, and it's a little bit more fun. We'll talk about the blade in detail. Uh, it's very enjoyable, so stand by. One method of testing a blade is what we call Tamishigiri, or test cutting. And what we're cutting through is tatami amote, which is the top of a tatami mat. Uh, rolled up and soaked in water, it approximates the Tense, the tension that you'd feel, the resistance you feel going through flesh. It's a traditional testing method, been around for a thousand years. Uh, it's a little more difficult than it looks, and only blades worth their weight are actually able to cut through it. The story of this blade is very interesting. Komukagi literally means shadow in Japanese and is drawn from the designer's lifelong passion of all things G.I. Joe. The designer, Sijo Weisun Johnny Sai, is a lifelong martial artist and he wanted to create something that he saw since his childhood, a functional snake eyes type sword. Now he wanted to show the influence but did not want to make an identical sword of the comics. He drew the sword to his favorite Eskrima stick length of 24 inches, which he found good for close range combat. With some work, and following to some design changes and modifications, the Kumukagi was born. If we move to a target that's a little bit lighter and thinner, speed and sharpness are really going to determine whether it works. Cutting water bottles, obviously enjoyable, is really a good test to see what the blade is worth. Well, I have to be honest with you, <laughs> that was a lot of fun. I enjoy cutting, obviously it's a passion of mine. The Kumukagi did a fantastic job. Uh, as you saw, even after a lot of cutting, it retained its razor edge. I was really impressed with that. I've seen a lot of short swords uh, that look cool, that feel pretty cool, uh, but they're not really that sharp. They're more of a hacking implement. This, my friends, is a fighting blade. Applications? Well, I hear people talk a lot about bug out bags. I would definitely include this in a bug out bag. Uh, it's it's pretty darn nice, nice and heavy, but not overweight where it's or it's cumbersome or uncomfortable to carry. So, hope you enjoyed it. Look it up, get some more information, and until I see you next time, stay safe.